It's my annual Oscar party. I'm very excited that Oscars are back this year. To see everything come to life again, you know, warms my heart. I, I just, I love Hollywood and I love making movies. I love telling stories. I love everything about this night because it celebrates everybody in the audience and it's amazing how many talented people, who cares if one wins? It takes so many people to be talented, to make something amazing. And I do that every single day of my life. So when this day comes, I think everybody's secretly celebrating themselves. You know, I just think it's great we're doing it. We're outside, it's back, it doesn't matter who wins, we're all, we all win. Yeah. Favorite picks for tonight, for Oscars? No, I'm keeping myself strictly, strictly neutral. I'm just going to wait and enjoy everything. I've seen almost everything. I am um, the young man in the movie with Benedict Cumberbatch. I thought for supporting actor, I thought he was extraordinary. And otherwise, I'm just keep my lips sipped. So, do you have any favorites for Oscars for tonight? Uh, you yes. know, I I'm, I lean towards the women directors and you know the women producers and stuff. So I'm always in their favor. Yep. I just completed a, um, a feature film with Bruce Willis that'll be released in July, in July 15th, called Wrong Place. And uh, Ashley Green is stars in uh, the movie that I'm doing right now with Bruce. And uh, she's an amazing actress. Uh, she's he's easy to work with, very talented. They're both just amazing talents. And I love that I've been able to make movies where we have you know, a female lead in the role, uh, where the, the hero is actually a woman. I think that's a really cool thing and, and a, a nice shift to see in movies and, you know, nothing better than having Bruce Willis as your, you know, supporting man. And you are the Oscar woman, right? I know, like your good luck charm tonight. Yeah. Well, hopefully every day, but I think tonight specifically. Yes. So tell us about this a little bit. Uh, we did the shoot a couple of weeks ago and I think spiritually, psychologically, on so many other levels, I think as a creatives we all sort of, you know, it's like a final destination almost to so many of us. So Oscar has never been a woman, has it? And I thought to be the actual Oscar there for other artists, it was so fun. And we did this with the lady who has actually an Oscar. Uh, for body paints, Heiwon was the one who made me look this way. So it was a very special day. So here we are at the Jonathan Baker Estate at this amazing Oscar party. Tell us a little bit about it. Oh, so Jonathan approached us to partner with Indie Entertainment Media and French Riviera Fest Film Festival. And I was really excited because we've never done an Oscar party with our magazine. So it turned out to be a win-win for all. We um, have great sponsors, great event, and we're just excited about the Oscars tonight. We partnered with Di Fiore New York, and that is um, a scarf designer, um, Italian silk scarves that is a sunflower motif, and we partnered with them, the French Riviera Film Festival, um, because sunflowers are the official flower of Ukraine, and $30 from every scarf she sells will go to the people of Ukraine. So, yeah. Oh, that's beautiful, really needed right now.